Caritas is the Church's touch of love towards her children, as described by His Holiness Pope Francis. It is the organism entrusted by the Church to work on its behalf for respect of human dignity and basic fundamental rights. With unconditional love and no discrimination, Caritas Lebanon fulfills the needs of Lebanon's most vulnerable people through its 36 sectors, its regional centers, and its various programs and projects. Because healthcare is a right for all, Caritas Lebanon throughout its 10 medical social centers covers the primary medical needs of the most vulnerable people. Provided services include a wide range of preventive and curative services, ranging from full medical exams to the provision of basic medicine. The centers also focus on school health programs, health awareness and prevention campaigns for all ages, as well as on the assistance of children with learning disabilities. Around 367,000 primary health services were provided by Caritas Lebanon's medical social centers in 2013, while the 13 mobile clinics serving 500 villages across Lebanon provided 209,000 services, such as examination, blood tests, and medicine. As it is every child's right to learn, play, and enjoy all sorts of recreational activities, Caritas Lebanon assigned several social projects including the promotion and the protection of the rights of the child. These programs comprise Atfaluna, which emphasizes on the right of the child and society's duties and responsibilities towards them. 1,600 children are directly benefiting from this program, which is funded by Caritas France. Funded by Caritas France and HSBC Bank, the after-school program supported and protected 450 children in the poor suburbs of Bersh Hamoud, Naba, Biblos, Tripoli, Zahle, and Klaya. The Center for the Promotion and Protection of Rights of the Child in Darul Ahmar, North Bika, was founded in partnership with the Sisters of the Good Shepherd and is financed by Manos Unidas and Caritas Germany. Caritas also supervises and assists 350 children through its AVSI program and aids an additional 550 to 2,000 child through its recent programs for the support of pupils in eight public schools. Besides, the Sponsor a Child program aims at involving the Lebanese diaspora in supporting the most vulnerable children. Caritas sectors and young volunteers always have in mind the welfare of children. Therefore, they organize across the country summer camps and various activities in order to enhance their daily life and widen their horizons. Because it also has a responsibility towards children with special needs, Caritas fosters 81 students, providing them with academic, psychological and social support in its Center for Persons with Specific Needs in Fral. Another 183 students benefit from Patsyar's Fair Center for Persons with Difficulties in Sahra, alongside the additional 22 students with learning difficulties in Hope Center in Onaitra, Beit Shabib, established in October 2013. The elderly are not forgotten either. Caritas Lebanon works to reduce their isolation and support them socially, psychologically, as well as providing medical assistance through its daycare centers, namely the Friendship Meal restaurants, Daruna, and the Oasis of Life. Besides, the charity home for the elderly in Ankit Akkar accommodates around 35 elderly in a warm family atmosphere. Finally, Caritas offers financial and moral assistance to 1,000 of needy elderly through the Third Age program led in collaboration with the Ministry of Social Affairs. Caritas also aims at encouraging the education of youth students through its Institute for Technical Education and Training in Zahle, thus benefiting 229 students. The Technical Loan Program was also launched in October 2013 in collaboration with the Bank of Beirut. Caritas Lebanon sends its young volunteers as messengers spreading the love amongst the most vulnerable and needy people nationwide. Under the slogan, Live With Us, You Will Know the Meaning, they dedicate their time to charitable activities such as rehabilitating the home of poor families, comforting the forgotten, and eliminating their faces. Additionally, they carried out small development projects funded by Caritas France, or others such as the activation of economical work funded by Caritas Australia and set up in cooperation with international Orthodox Christian charities, Lebanon and Catholic Relief Services, and benefiting both Lebanese and Syrians. In order to preserve the land and maintain farmers on their land, Caritas Lebanon implemented mainly in rural areas projects such as agricultural development and productivity projects, designed to enhance agricultural activities. A recent project, namely Baladi, funded by USAID, was launched to support municipalities. Through its cooperative of the charity and its brand name in Tajuna, Caritas Lebanon markets rural production. Finally, in 2013, 1,300 people expanded their small trades through the microcredit program set up in cooperation with the Bank of Beirut. 
In respect to all human beings and regardless of their nationality, Caritas Lebanon provides migrant workers and refugees fleeing to Lebanon with social, humanitarian and legal assistance through projects funded by foreign institutions and encompassing about 45,000 beneficiaries. On the basis of its humanitarian duty towards everyone, especially in times of emergency, Caritas assists with no discrimination, right Syrian refugees across Lebanon since the start of the Syrian crisis. Caritas assisted a total of 180,000 displaced Syrians as well as Lebanese hosting communities through the help of Caritas sisters, UN agencies, and governmental and private institutions. Caritas Lebanon emphasizes more than ever on solidarity, to witness the Lord's love towards our neediest brothers and sisters. Together, we can make a difference in their lives, and with the loving and kind spirit of people, we know that, yes, together, we will make that difference.